West Africa's coastal areas host an abundance of natural resources on land and at sea that provide vital ecosystem services and help buffer against severe weather conditions. The West African coastal area is said to be one of the most threatened coastal areas in the world in terms of ecological problems. It was in a bid to help countries access expertise and funds to sustainably manage these ecological problems and also deal with them decisively that the West Africa Coastal Areas Management Program was established. As you are aware, the benefits of the worker are quite immense. Worker will help Nigeria obtain financing and expertise to sustainably manage her coastal areas, enhance industrial competitiveness, market access, innovation and investment promotion. It will also promote productive employment for rural communities and entrepreneurship development, as well as sustainable energy and environmental management. Since 2016, when Nigeria became part of the Waka project, implementation has remained a challenge. The Federal Environment, having consulted with other stakeholders, requested in a letter to the Federal Minister of Finance on the 20th of June 2018 for a project preparatory fund of $4,200,000, which is about 2% of the proposed cost of the worker project. But unfortunately, the PPF is yet to be made available. And as such, we have not been able to record any reasonable milestone in terms of project implementation. Most of our coastline, which is about 180 kilometer stretch, is actually challenged in terms of erosion. Um, as I said earlier, Lagos State has invested heavily. I, I'm, I'm very sure it's one of the state, if not the only state that has even done something to start tackling the erosion. However, we notice that it's such a large thing that needs a holistic approach. That is why we, th we feel that it should be a communal or rather a national issue that should be tackled from that angle. The coastal area is so wide, like we have about 203 kilometers, you know. And that uh, if you look at the coastal area, some of the communities are going in extinction. And so the impact of this erosion in Biosasset is so enormous that we are afraid that most of these communities will be wiped away because of the danger of this erosion. This National Stakeholders Technical Meeting is therefore geared towards facilitating the implementation process for Nigeria towards improving the livelihood of coastal communities.